The person put on blast, accused of stealing peacocks from a North Valley neighborhood, is now telling his side of the story. He says whoever posted the pictures of his car and put flyers up all over have it all wrong, and they're putting his family in danger. News 13's Carlos Sosa is live near Rio Grande and Matthew with the story. Kim, the man who owns the car that was on, a, on all of those flyers, says it's all a misunderstanding, but says he has an idea of how all of this could have started. Michael Cruz lives in the North Valley neighborhood known for its peacocks. He says his 13 year old sister loves to look at the peacocks when he's driving her to school. Somebody came out and said, What are you doing? Uh, and my sister was taking pictures of peacocks outside the car. And she said, Oh, just taking pictures. And a week later, we saw the flyers. So we're not sure if that triggered something. He's talking about these flyers. They're posted on power pole lines along Matthew Avenue. On the flyers, you can see pictures of two of his cars along with license plate numbers. The driver is referred to as the peacock poacher. That has his family on edge. They don't want people coming to the house, recognizing the cars, and saying, these are the peacock guys, we're going to get them, we're going to go to their front door. I mean, it, that worries my mom, my sister, and my grandma. Cruz says he has nothing to hide and just wants to clear up this misunderstanding. If a cop needs to come over here and check, he can. I mean, any officer can come over here and do an evaluation on the front yard, backyard, anything they need to. This person that's putting the flyers out, I just want to tell him that he's real, this is getting creepy. So I want him to know that please stop. People we've talked to in the neighborhood said they don't know who started putting up those flyers. Back to you. Okay, thanks, Carla. Now, Cruz said he has taken some of the flyers down, especially the ones near his house.